So, sometimes you just need a hand with more control. Not a problem. Click the first bone of a finger. Then shift click the bone above it. Press control, shift, C, R. And make sure that only Z is checked. And then change both of these to local space. Then click the bone and shift click the last part of the finger. And repeat the process. You will now see that if you start bending the first joint, the entire finger will curl in and out. Do this for the other three fingers. And when you get to the thumb, I recommend only doing this for the last joint. Because the thumb can do a lot more than the other four. Change the bone shapes to custom and then hide all the useless bones. You're done. Now you can control the entire hand with this. If you want to close the hand, select these four and rotate it in. You can also rotate it out to open. The cool thing about this setup is it also allows you to keep control of the side finger rotation, single finger control, and unique thumb positions. Hope that helps. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring that bell. Hope you have a fantastic day, and I'll see you around.